Okay guys, here we go. Sunday afternoon. These little bastards are here. About 50 of those guys. These are what they call a bald-faced hornet. And uh, they're menacing. They're bad. They're bad enough for me to spend almost 200 bucks on bee protective gear so I can get into my shop and actually get rid of them. It's getting a little dark here, so i got to get some lighting. So bear with me for a sec. get this thing set up what we're gonna do later tonight when those guys go to sleep we're going to get rid of them so I can't see anything up there it's a pretty precarious spot and in order to be successful, this has to be done once. And I can see them buzzing all around up there. And they're none too impressed with what I'm doing, but they're leaving me alone, as far as I know. They have a sting that's five times worse than a hornet. Excuse me, a wasp. So, I don't want to get stung by one. So what I'm going to do is everything I can to not have that happen. All right, so light set up. Let's see if we can get you a better look at this thing. There we go. bit better from what I gathered on the interwebs there's probably gonna be you know 150 maybe 200 in that thing so that's actually a one of the smallest ones that I've seen on the internet give it another month and that thing could be about four feet big four feet long tall or whatever so I'm trying to find where they're going in and coming out and I think I see it, which is going to be a very difficult proposition. But nonetheless, I'm pretty sure you can actually hear this whole shop humming with bees. I'm pretty sure we're going to get it taken care of this evening. So till then, 